Rice is an essential factor for living, especially at present when population density is increasing. The demand of rice is increasing as well. To ensure foodstuff production, particularly sufficient rice production, ASEAN member countries have imposed policies for its member countries to concentrate on sustainable and secure food production, focusing on clean agricultural production, which places no harm to plantation soil. Along with ensuring establishment of national rice reserve and ASEAN emergency rice reserve. การคําประกันเสบียงอาหารและโภชนาการทั้งภาษาอังกฤษเพื่อเรื่อง food security และก็ nutrition ทั้งหมายว่าถือเป็นปัญหาของโลกเลย Food security and nutrition is not only the issue within Lao PDR, but of worldwide concern, and is included in Millennium Development Goals or NBG or Sustainable Development Goals or SDGs. Thus, UNDP directs its membership countries of organization worldwide to pay attention to food security and nutrition issue. Lao PDR, as an ASEAN family country, particularly during AEC, spend under the campaign of single market and production base. This means wherever within ASEAN member countries, rice and food production is not only serving for domestic consumption, but for the whole member countries, especially where is insufficient production or issue arise. This does not mean that other countries do not desire to make production, but might be because insufficient climate factors supporting production in such countries. Therefore, besides sufficient production for local consumption, it is required to make supplement production for other ASEAN countries when they are in need. To ensure sufficient food production with increasing demand, thus rice production is defined as the focal point for foodstuff, which is establishment of national rice reserves in ten provinces throughout the country. It is among the government's action plans for food security, which is the first priority to achieve determining goals of national rice production program and animal and aquatic grazing promotion program, along with clean agriculture and focal rice production. Besides that, the government will improve necessary policies for rice production and animal husbandry for foodstuff expansion in both quantity and quality. This is to cater increasing demand of foodstuff. Okay, Mang Chan, was a one that was tied to the National Rice Commission. Regarding strategy and vision of agriculture and forestry sector, it is mainly associated with ensuring the country's food security by sustainable agriculture and agricultural production development with both quantity and quality. This is to contribute in forming basis and economy along with the path of industrialization and modernization, the main target set by the central and provincial authorities. Thus, in Vientiane Province, adjacent to Vientiane Capital and associated with seven large plain plateaus, has favorable conditions in terms of sustainable location of water source. Our main strategy is that we have water source, which is Nam Ngum River, running from dam to dam to Vientiane Capital, and we take this as our production potential. Particularly, we use irrigation for pumping water for production and food source. Along with irrigation system improvement in order to ensure agricultural production, there is also application of new technique for rice plantation. The concerned sector has collaborated with farmer groups to conduct practical implementation. Here is a field of farmer groups at Punhong Nafai Village, Tolokom District, Vientian Province, which are under a pilot project of large rice field and soil quality upgrade by application of organic fertilizer. Experimental, it is found that the production yield has been increased from previously 2.5 tons per hectare in the last season into 3.5 tons per hectare. To tell the truth, previously this village area used to have low quality land for rice plantation. The maximum capacity was only 2.5 tons per hectare. At present, the Land Management and Development Department has recognized this issue and provided assistance in fertilizer production for rice fields, especially this plot of rice field. 
Through maintenance and caretaking, we have gained production of 3.8 tons per hectare, which means it has been increased from 2.5 tons to 3.8 tons. It is proof that the new method introduced by the government in farming larger rice fields is approaching to be success of 5 tons per hectare. Large area of pilot land still has been left. Currently, we have conducted within only 4 hectares. When we got good yield, we will expand to other areas of project members because here is a merely a pilot area. Relying on residual water from power production from Nammang 3 Dam, it has become a key source of water supply for rice production in focal area in Tolokom District, Vientiane Province, where it is one among food source of the country. Improvement of appropriate irrigation system, it could supply water for agricultural production. This has been done in combination of application of focal rice production technique, which is a complete set system and has become approach that applied by concerned sector in an effort of implementing food security capacity in general, in particular encouragement of food production, processing, flow and trade, aiming at in upgrading living condition of farmers to a better level, encouraging relation for sufficient food production with firm residual at national, provincial, district and family levels. This means it is required to cause development and establishment of secure reserve system in compliance with ASEAN system, as well as international system for a shake of natural disasters and economic crisis. These will become challenges that require appropriate planning and measures to ensure food security, contributing into socio-economic development as well as regional growth and stability.